as you know, Rick, you know, for the past couple years was commissioned by Joe Ernst, so, you know, we were just having a chat, and I was like, you know, there's a lot of players that quit the travel team, there's a lot of extra players that maybe still want to play basketball, they're just not willing to commit, so I thought, you know, maybe we should start a rec league. So, you know, Joe Ernst, he was on to it immediately, sent out some email blasts, and next thing you know, we've got a rec league. We have the red team, we have the black team. The blue and the mighty green team. Basically, you just have a classic, you know, two teams play back to back, then they play a different team each week, because it's one game a week, no practices, the players love it, it's just absolutely great. Everyone makes the playoffs, because you know, that's what we're about in rec, and yeah. I don't really see rec as a league, I kind of see it as a whole big family. We're open to welcome new members, the league is open to all members, I assure you. That's why Alex is the prime example here, he's coming from all the way from Saddle River, or Upper, upper Saddle River, excuse me. Uh, currently we play at the middle school arena, it's a, it's a nice arena, there's stands for people. What is it like to run? the rec Instagram account. I would say it is quite an honor. I would say it it takes some it takes some courage. Sometimes you just gotta put it up so that your fans could know what happened. I'm the league statistician and I do not play and or record. However we've got some good people. We've got David Vigiano. He records for the games. He does great work and I just hope he can continue doing that. There is a big athletic growth because some people play in rec you know, they're, n they're never out, they're usually just home, so, you know, for them to go out, play basketball. I'd say that they've just been growing tremendously with all the great coaching. We do have some volunteer coaches. Uh, uh, Jack Ferrari, he left personal issues off court. He was a great coach. His, uh, he coached. His uh, total coaching record was 1-0. And then we have Ryan McCarthy, great coach, you know, dresses nice. That's that's basically what we want in a coach. And, you know, he coaches to win. He's serious. This is rec. And then there is a social aspect to rec. I think that is the greatest thing with rec. You just make so many new friends. You have so much fun. And, yeah. I do hope we can plan some rec events, perhaps a rec dinner, rec lunch, or rec brunch. I only see a bright future for rec. I see no reason why this league should stop in any way or form. It's just going to be a great season to watch. I hope I can see you there in the stands. Did I mention if I'm being paid yet?